a surgical glue that may save the lives of some of our most vulnerable patients. This is our muscle gratiné. Inside the kitchen at the French Bistro Plouffe. We do muscles so many different ways. Steamed, grilled, or lathered in butter, mussels are on the menu. That's our number one thing. But now the tasty mollusk is serving up more than just a satisfying meal. It was very surprising. It was a, a wonderful insight. The shellfish have inspired bioengineers at UC Berkeley to design a new kind of glue, one that will stick and stay stuck completely underwater and that's going to help these babies in utero. It's really exciting to to think that we might have an opportunity to to improve lives or even save lives. With fetal surgery doctors operate through a pregnant woman's uterus to perform a life-saving procedure on her fetus but afterwards the incision can spring a leak of amniotic fluid and that can trigger premature birth. Dr. Michael Harrison pioneered fetal surgery at UCSF. This is a totally unsolved problem. To date, no medical adhesive exists that can reliably seal the incision shut. And we've tried a hundred different ways. Enter Professor Philip Messersmith of Cal and his research team. Messersmith noticed how muscles can glue themselves to a surface and stay put even in pounding surf. Muscles have to actually be anchored onto a surface in order to survive. As seen in this sped up video using its foot, a muscle lays down what's called a bissel thread. These threads or tethers are made out of a special recipe of proteins. Once in water, they anchor the muscles snugly into place using a kind of super glue. So the amazing thing is that it makes glue underwater. The lab at Cal synthesized the protein and made an adhesive. Using a sausage casing cut in half, the team demonstrated how the muscle superglue works. Nature is the expert and as engineers we look to nature to figure out how we can take the things that nature have already perfected and use them in the human world to solve really important challenges. The glue needs FDA approval before it's used in fetal surgery, but the inspiration is already inspiring these medical doctors and students. To look and see that it exists in nature, I mean, that's such a, such a perfect way to solve the problem. It makes me wonder, you know, all these other creatures that I don't think twice about, like what could that be 10 years from now, 20 years from now? As for the executive chef at Plouffe? Next I see a customer send their muscles back, not finish. I'm going to go back out there, say, hey, these are very important here. These can save people's lives. Well, of course, if you can deliver an infant closer to term, the baby will have a potentially fewer, fewer health complications, not to mention lower health care costs. The, this research was funded by the National Institutes of Health.